Daily Spicy Lifers. It's Annette Daly, also known as the Hot Pepper Queen. Welcome to Taco Tuesday. We are um, doing a recipe from Taco, the Taco Cleanse Book. The Taco, can you imagine a, a Taco Cleanse Book? So, it's kind of, thankfully, Johnny Angel has helped me <laughs> with preparing the taco cleanse because it's, it's, a, it's a major or two. Oh, my God. Okay. But Johnny Angel has helped me. <laughs> hey, Cheryl. Johnny Angel has helped me with the, um, it's, it's kind of like, Doing chili and a chili cook-off, Cheryl. But <laughs> hey, Christine. But it's 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 a taco cleanse. Hey, Michelle. Mm -hmm. We're I'm attempting. <laughs> hey, Shelly Tuzlino. I'm doing a taco cleanse. Have you ever have you ever heard of such a thing? Ain't that crazy? So crazy. Thank the Lord Jesus, Johnny Angel has helped me prepare because um, my job is to help and teach people. Cheryl Turner, I miss you. Hey, Diane. Uh, my job is to teach busy people how to solve the what's for dinner dilemma problem with real food fast. Okay, this recipe, this recipe is not that. This recipe, hey Ellie, Sue Reagan. Oh, damn, this is so awesome to see all my girlfriends. Okay, so I um, help people solve the what's for dinner dilemma with real food, real fast problem, but <sighs> This recipe is not, this recipe isn't that. Hey, Cynthia! <laughs> so glad to see ya. Um, so Johnny Angel has helped me prepare for this. Uh, taco cleanse. Oh, my heavens and Betsy. <laughs> it's, it's, um, it's vegan. Johnny Angel's like, oh. I told him it was a, a, a fish recipe. He's like, and I was like, well, it's not really fish, John. <laughs> And it, it's tofu. It's tofu! And, of course, I'm new at this. I don't have everything exactly right. <laughs> but it's all good. It's all good. Ah! I did. Yay! Thanks, Heather. Love you. So, you guys. Oh, my heavens to Betsy. A lot of prep in this one. A lot of prep in this one. Because... We're on a taco cleanse. Um, well, we're on a taco cleanse for as long as I can handle it. As long as Johnny Angel will help me with preparing for it. Uh, no tofu! <laughs> well, that's what Johnny Angel used to say, too. And When you fry it up in a pan, Cynthia and Ellie, uh, it is really good. I'm hoping this one will be too. Johnny Angel used to freak out when I had this other Pampered Chef recipe. It was a uh, fried tofu with, um, oh, it was so good with some um, breadcrumbs, with some Parmigiana. Hey, Cindy. And some um, spaghetti uh, uh, Mariana sauce. He loved it. He always See, you're going like this. Mm, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Keep an open mind, everybody. <laughs> Keep an open mind. Okay, so I will tell you, I'm feeling a little challenged. This is so um, healthy, which I'm okay with healthy. I'm okay with healthy. But this is uh, a lot of moving parts. A lot of moving parts. So if you beautiful women and men will share the broadcast, um, give me some comments, say netters, 
It's okay if you screw up. Just keep going. Everybody screws up. <laughs> so that's that's what I would love. Happy Taco Tuesday, everybody. Thank you for joining in. So it's Taco Tuesday. My friend <laughs> recommended this book. All right, so what we're having in Johnny Angel, he did this, which y'all were doing. Yeah, it is. Um, so what we're having, it's very interesting. It's a three, it's a three-part book. We're having fish tacos. Hey, Linda! But they're not really fish tacos. Um, so I was so damn happy <clears throat> when Johnny Angel made you made a um, homemade tartar sauce, right? Okay, I'll, I'll go into that. Let me just taste it. Johnny Angel made it. And <laughs> it's so interesting when your honey angel makes the food. It's like, oh, that's really good. Like, John, you just made homemade tartar sauce. He had no idea. He had no idea. <laughs> so interesting, isn't it? I'm like, I think that's why they're calling it fish tacos because there are no fish. This is vegan, vegan. Um, I think they're calling it fish tacos because it has the tartar sauce. And he's like, hmm, I'm not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure about all that, but that's okay. I'm going to try to do my best <laughs> to put this all together. So the first, okay, it is complicated. I hate to say it's complicated. But when you are a vegetarian and a vegan, it, I, I mean, I guess if, if you're out there in my audience and you're a vegetarian and a vegan, just please shout out. I, I think it's, it's a little challenging for a person who has grown up and enjoys eating meat. Fucking gravy in the morning. But we're just going to go on with it. So, when I is the first thing in the taco. <laughs> Love you, honey. Thank you, Ellie. The first thing is we're going to make the slaw that goes in the taco. And what that requires is some red cabbage. Red cabbage. All right. So I'm going to have to move this camera and I'm going to have to take off this hat. I can tell I have to take off my hat. Shoo! I've been wearing this <laughs> I had to wear my hat today because it was raining here in Central Virginia and you know sometimes you just don't want to fix your hair. <laughs> So here we go, everybody. We're going to make some um, bright light slaw. It requires some red cabbage. And it, it asks, the re recipe calls for it to be um, sliced. And I want to show you this. Oh, Cindy. Oh, thank you, Cindy. The bomb curl. Love you, sweetheart. Oh, it's fancy. Let me see. Okay, this is better. All right, guys. So I have already um, Julie and not really. <laughs> I cut up some red flaw and red some red cabbage. I got the small head. The small head. Okay, little, little, little. Mm -mm -mm -mm. And it says to Julie in it. You have to cut it up in corners and then take out the core and then it says Julie in it. But let me just tell you with this little paper chip tool, it's like the bomb in my opinion. Um, it's the quick slice. Somebody says, do you have a potato french fry cutter? I'm like, well, I don't think we have a, we don't have a french fry cutter. But we have this little quick slice. Cabbage stinks. Can you smell that? Ew. Oh, God. But it's all right. So, 
that. <laughs> okay, it works good, guys. Um, so I'm not chilling in it, but um, you could spend one hour julienning these. <laughs> or you could just put it in this quick slice. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Really, guys, another quick slice. But come on, are you gonna spend time cutting a knife the whole day on time? What about just using the Pembershire quick slice? gravy in the morning. Isn't that awesome? It's awesome sauce. If you think it's too thick, you can put it right back on there. I love, love, love it. Love, love, love it. Okay. So the slaw, <clears throat> good gravy in the morning. You'd think I was, <coughs> I was cooking tacos for an army. I <laughs> love Love, love, love Dan again too. Okay. So, we've got some slaw. I already did a bunch of orange juice on it. The slaw is very important. And Johnny Angel is a big coleslaw person. I've never, I don't, I'm not a big mayonnaise kind of gal. Hey, Doug Martin. Good for you, Mr. Pampered Chef King. I'm making um, some vegan, or trying to, uh, coleslaw um, fish tacos, which are really not fish. <laughs> hey, Sue. Hey, Grammy. Ah, happy New Year. Happy New Year, everybody. So excited. So excited to see all my friends join me on the Taco Tuesday. Okay, guys. Yes. <laughs> Thank the Lord and praise Jesus <laughs> that Johnny Angel helped me um, preparing this because I can tell you what. I love doing real food real quick. And in fact, I'm, uh, I'm getting really good at it, better and better and better. But this whole vegetarian, vegan, taco cleanse thing, it's, it's, it's much harder. It's much harder than you would think. <laughs> so y'all bear with me and thank the Lord that Johnny Angel helped me with it. <laughs> I like you, Becky Skill. Love you, honey. Love you, honey. Okay. Jesus said, you were blessed. Keep going. All right. So, uh, we have to do the slaw before we do the thick fish, which is really just um, tofu. All right. For the, you need juice of one large orange. <laughs> okay. Here we go. All right. We, I've already done the slaw. Y'all saw that, right? One, a juice of one orange. Good gravy. So I did not follow the directions every time. He is the best. Johnny Angel is the best. I did put some orange already in this, but you're supposed to put it in this bowl and whisk it. I've already put the olive oil. Oh my heavens to Betsy, if you do not have this Pampered Chef juicer, it's, in my opinion, in my humble opinion, it's so big. I mean, you can put a big old thing in there. All right, let me put my good gravy. I'm all, I'm, all, I'm busy. Oh, okay, see? I'm supposed to put one whole orange in there, and I, I put some already in, in the cabbage. This uh, Pampered Chef juicer is the bomb. Okay. Oh, God. It smells so good. It smells so good. Okay, I've already.
already, oh, I should tell you because I have already cut <laughs> oh, <laughs> some jalapeno in the dressing. Oh, I hate a mess. I hate a mess. I, I've already put some jalapeno in the dressing. So, for the bright slaw, it requires, I've already put two tablespoons of olive oil. Um, it, <laughs> one jalapeno I seeded and minced. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I had no idea. It's my first. I know I've minced garlic before with our garlic, paper chip garlic mincer, but I have never minced a jalapeno. <laughs> like, that's the hot pepper queen fancy pants love. So look at this. And it's got the juices. Well, you can mince it if you want to, but oh my heavens to Betsy, this is. <whistles> Fancy pants. Mm. Hey, Jesse. Jesse Chow. He's a chili man. Like, I just minced in our pepper chip garlic press a jalapeno. Lord. I might have something over here at the next chili cook-off, Jesse. <laughs> Unless I sell you one of these babies. It's so fun. So exciting. So exciting. Okay. We're making Bright Light Baja Slaw, which is the Jenny Angel Loves Coleslaw. I'm not a big coleslaw fan, but we're going to make this vegan. <laughs> hey, Tracy Puckett. Okay. So, uh, we have the orange juice, we have the olive oil, we have the, uh, the jalapeno, we need a tablespoon of agave nectar. I, we have them everywhere. I love you, Tracy. Thank you, honey. <laughs> One tablespoon of agave nectar. All right, we got that. Mm -hmm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. One teaspoon of cumin and one teaspoon of black pepper. Oh, I love our chili cherry black pepper. Okay, I love it. I love black pepper. That's good, right? And then uh, one teaspoon of cumin. Y'all having fun yet? Okay, good. Okay, one teaspoon of cumin. And, um, did I do the black pepper? Yes, I did. And uh, a quarter teaspoon of salt. There we go. Mmm. Himalayan. And then we're going to whisk this together. <laughs> I'm having some fancy. This paper chef whisk. Oh, I know you can do it in a, 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 a um, something that's going to scratch your pan, but this has the best pan. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I'm looking at myself in the camera. I was like, oh my heavens! Your four eyes. You have four eyes. Matters, you have four eyes. That's okay. I'm grateful that I can get glasses so I can see. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. To Mosapan. Mosapan. Let's see what it tastes like. Kind of sweet. That agave and the juice is kind of sweet. <laughs> Sherry! <laughs> Sherry David Hoga Davis. 
I'm working your program, girl. My mentor, my Taco Tuesday mentor lady. She's the bomb. I love her so much. <laughs> so Sherry, thank God for Johnny Angel helping me because this freaking taco cleanse. It's um it's not like taco soon. It's not like taco casserole. It's not like taco dip. This shit is healthy. <laughs> this, this, okay, I said a bad word. But, oh my goodness gracious. So, what I understand is all of these fabulous seasonings. Um, oh, mmm, mmm, yum, so good. It breaks, breaks down. That's right, that's a good thing. It seasons the red cabbage. Mmm, actually, it's really good, y'all. I know it's really good. Y'all know it's gonna be really good. You just have to be prepared for it. Okay, so the citric, just uh, the citric with the gin, uh, the OJ, makes it um, kind of like. When you do seafood with orange juice, and cooks it, right? Okay. Mmm. This is good. This is good. Oh, my heavens, some Betsy. This is yum. Yum, 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 yum. Okay, then you put it to the side. <laughs> there, it, it is a, it's a little sweet. A little bit. I love the balance though. Johnny Angel and I, when we cook chili, I, I like my chili a little sweeter than his. <laughs> we're, Sherry Hava Davis, we're making, from the taco clans, we're making, <laughs> we're making fish tacos. Not really. Okay, so this sits. This sits. I'm having some fancy. The next step. Mm, mm, mm. Mm, that is so good, y'all. I likey, likey, likey. Okay. So Johnny Angel, praise the Lord and hallelujah, has already made the tartar sauce. Let me show you what that is. Oh, what is so for the tartar sauce, he, he had no idea. It's so exciting. <laughs> he's like, oh, fish, ooh, ick. But he loves, he's a mayonnaise king, which I'm not. So I don't even know if I'm going to like this. I will probably like it. Let me just try it. So he's a big old mayonnaise king. He doesn't eat fish at all, but will eat tuna from a can because he adds like a half a jar of mayonnaise to it. <laughs> so Johnny Angel likes this. Um, we made homemade tartar sauce. Oh my heavens, Betsy, you can't see it. I'm sorry. So the homemade tartar sauce with the taco cleanse, because it's all vegan. You know, ours is not vegan, but you can go vegan. Uh, we live in the boondocks. They don't, they don't have vegan mayonnaise where we live. <laughs> Thank you for your thumbs up. It only requires one cup of vegan mayo. Two tablespoons of diced pickles and one tablespoon of diced capers. I love capers. Hey, Leanne. Um, uh, capers, I love olives. I love an anything salty. So, Johnny Angel, praise the Lord, made this ahead of time. <laughs> okay. Don't you love it when you, somebody can help you achieve a goal? 
so here comes here comes the interesting part. <coughs> We've got the slow marinating, and we have the uh, a tartar sauce on my heaven to Betsy. Here comes what is called the iridescent fried tofu. Gravy in the morning. This is a big deal. So, let me show you. Actually, I might. I want to take a break and I want to know what are you having for Taco Tuesday, everybody? I'm not progressing until you tell me. I don't care if it's tacos or not. What are you doing and what are you eating for Taco Tuesday? Please share because I'm, I'm having fun busting my ass with you. <laughs> tell me what you're eating. What are you eating? It's Taco Tuesday. What are you eating? Can't wait to hear. Tell me what you're eating. No dinner yet? Good gravy in the morning. Did you have a late lunch, Heather? <laughs> All right. No dinner yet. I love you, Heather. Thank you for being here and commenting. Such a doll baby. Such a leader. Like, like a leader in the nth degree. Leader in the nth degree. Love you. What about you, Happy? Oh, chicken alfredo noodles. <laughs> All right, skinny mini. That's good for you, Sherry. Um, Corn dogs and fries, mm. and you had an apple. Mmm, that sounds good, Cindy. Corn dog and fries. Yumma, yumma. <laughs> yumma, yumma. <laughs> okay, hard to believe. <laughs> so this is the thing about, well, I have no idea. I'm pontificating was about to, and I'm not going to. Um, so I'm about to fry up <laughs> some tofu in an amazing pan. I'm glad I finally got a Pamper Chef good pan <laughs> that doesn't stick. Oh, God, I forgot. So I'm not, I'm not going to diss anything. I'm just trying to... Trying to do the right thing. Oh, I'm having some Betsy. So what I'm supposed to do, let me do it. Let me try to do it. Like a good person, like a good um, pampered chef. Doesn't have to be perfect chef, remember? So guys, it calls for a couple of tablespoons of canola oil. I'm not used to cooking with this, but um, frying in the pan. Oh, good gravy. <laughs> Is part of, oh my God. I'm so excited about my new pepper chip pan, y'all. I'm so tired of, well, if y'all you been following me, oh, my heavens to Betsy. I am so excited about this pan, and y'all can read my face if it doesn't work. <laughs> um, Cause I'm pretty honest, I'll tell you the truth. But this is my new Pamper Chef skillet. So excited! It's the executive part of it. Oh, good gravy! Hope I can follow the recipe. I'm so delighted about the pan. <laughs> I'm sorry. Hey, Lori. Lori, I'm I'm trying to be healthy with the taco cleanse and be vegan. Oh my heavens, to Betsy. <laughs> okay, actually, I wish Johnny Angel was here to help me. I'm supposed to. Well, let me tell you, Johnny Angel's already done this for me. 
This is a big deal. We have the powdered part of the bread. And that is um, a half a cup of flour, three tablespoons of garlic powder, three teaspoons of paprika, three teaspoons of salt, uh, one and a half teaspoons of black pepper, um, a quarter cup of Dijon mustard, that's in the second bowl, and uh, a quarter cup of water, and a cup of panko or other vegan bread crumbs. Okay, so I bought this extra firm, already pre-cut tofu. I thought it was, oh, look, I'm so on top of it. <laughs> and then I realized it's not exactly right. So we're just, you know what? We're just gonna go with it. <laughs> As y'all know, it's, I don't, we do not have to be perfect here on Taco Tuesday. We only have to be pampered. So I'm heating this up slowly. As a Johnny Angel can you help me, can you wait? And you're supposed to do the, the one hand dry, one hand wet. Oh my heavens, so fancy. <laughs> Let me make sure I'm doing it right. <clears throat> Ain't this crazy? Y'all watching me being the newest new cook? Okay. You. On the pan heats branded tofu. Here's the tofu. I squished it all out. Unfortunately, I did buy it pre-cut. You should have done it differently. Hey, hey, Shirley T. I'm not perfect all the time, Shirley T. <laughs> okay. Uh, designate one hand wet and one hand dry. With your wet hand, Grab a tofu triangle and drop it into the flour mixture. Which it's okay. And then using your dry hand, flip the tofu over so it gets covered in flour. <laughs> Dustin, Ranch, are you a good cook, Dustin? You went from balm to hairy, and I love it. <laughs> you know, I love I love it. <laughs> oh, my heavens, to Betsy. Okay. So, all right, I got my little tofu crumbles. Can't be in the morning. I am so out of my comfort zone. I am so out of my comfort zone. Oh, my heavens, to Betsy. Oh, well. Oh, well. We just keep going. <laughs> Then place the tofu into the mustard mixture, being sure not to get your dry hand wet. Okay, this is fine. <laughs> okay, good. Oh my heavens, a bad thing. Okay, gravy. So I haven't touched anything with, because this has all been pre-prepared, pre-prepared, pre-prepared. Just want the good stuff. I don't want a bunch of ick. I right? just, I just want the tofu. Don't need all the flour. We didn't, we did not have as much tofu as we thought. And, and it's good because this is an experiment. It's an experiment. Okay, so I'm taking. I think I'm supposed to take my right hand and do it with the um, mustard sauce, but. Johnny, oh my heavens, so fancy. This looks, oh my god. I don't know. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, this is really globby. This is really globby. This is very globby. 
Very gloppy. Oh, good gravy in the morning. Okay, let's see. Good gravy. Very gloppy. Not like it's supposed to be in the book where you have the big old squares. Good day in the morning. Okay. And then, um, and then we're supposed to go with the breadcrumbs. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. I am in a new place. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, I can do this. Ain't this the weirdest thing? Hey, Lauren, I'm trying to do a, a vegan taco cleanse. <laughs> and it is very unique one. It is much more um, challenging than if you were frying hamburger up in a pan. That's all I got to say about that. <laughs> hey, I'm up for a challenge. I love challenges. I don't, I'd like to win. I want to win. I always want to be successful, but it's all good. It's all good. You don't have to be perfect all the time. <laughs> so funny. I cannot believe. Thank goodness gracious. So this is this whole Sherry Havar Davis, this whole vegan cleanse taco thing. Oh my heavens, so fancy. Good gravy in the morning. This is um, something else. <laughs> but it's okay, it's fun. It's fun to try something new, right, you guys? So, I am, I have, can you see this? Um, it's a really, the recipe is pretty cool with all the, um, Different spices. <laughs> Jenny Angel said, Oh, not ours. You're going to be um, <clears throat> dirtying up some dishes. I'm like, oh. Once again, so Johnny Angel and I live in BFE, so we don't go out to eat very often. And long and behold, we always have a dag on dirty kitchen. It's hard to catch up if you eat at home all the time. And Johnny Angel and I work from home <laughs> most of the time. Okay, good gravy in the morning. <laughs> I'll tell you what these seasonings are. And they're pretty special. Yummy, yummy. Are we having fun yet with the taco clans? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Okay. Let me rinse my hands and then we're gonna fry them up in the pan. And it's, and it's gonna be delicious. Taco Tuesday. I have friends from all over the country watching me. Miss Sherry Havar Davis, my Taco Tuesday mentor, who said, no, 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 you should order this book. The cooks in a two week book off, uh, and 52 weekends in a week and a year. How many do you cook, sweetheart? A bench. Oh my god, it's a bench. So experimental. <laughs> okay, I have canola oil in there. Oh my god, it's a bench. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh yeah, we have the panko. I'll tell you all the rest. I'm at heaven, so Betsy. This recipe is for 
I really, 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 really have to give it up to the vegetarians, the vegans. That I mean, it really is a labor of love. It's a labor of love. Those people, man, oh my, that's fussy. Thank you for giving me some hearts. Make sure that you're sharing. Okay. <laughs> while the head, uh, while the pan heats, I've read the tofu. We've done all that. And fry the tofu in batches of three to four pieces. Well, the tofu, okay, it'll be fine. We did it in diff different ways. It'll be fine. For two minutes on each side, of course, they're balls, like meatballs. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, thank you, Heather. Good gravy in the morning. Thank you for sharing. Thank you for sharing. <laughs> You're supposed to brown them on each side. They're not triangles like this book calls for. Because, you know, I'm not a triangle. I'm not an angle person. I'm more of a round person. So I made them into balls. Well, because I bought the wrong kind of tofu. Because I'm not used to buying tofu. <laughs> Do y'all buy tofu on a regular basis? I... I've only, I, mean, I, I would have to say this is probably my fifth time only of ever buying tofu. And I'm not opposed to tofu. Okay. Turn it up. Turn it up. <laughs> okay. Two minutes on each side. Send set on paper towels or a cooling rack to chain. And in between batches, let the oil reheat for 30 minutes. Well, I have the big bad ass. <laughs> hey, Meredith. I have the big bad ass um, pampered chef thing, so there's not going to be any waiting. Meredith, I love you. It's been a long time, girlfriend. I know you're in the catering business. I'm trying to do a um, taco cleanse vegan thing this evening. It's going to be good. I, I, have the, I just, well, you know, I've been listening to Joel Osteen for two days on the XM radio. And so you cannot be but hopeful that your tacos <laughs> is are, are going to turn out okay. You know, does anybody else listen to <laughs> Joe Osteen? Joe, Joe, Joel Osteen. Yeah, I don't like stuff. Okay, I think I'm going to do it. I think I'm going to do it. Oh, my head is the bad scene. Okay, here we go, everybody. <laughs> Do you know to tell if the oil's hot? You're supposed to with some water. All right, Miss Sherry, let me go see. Let me go see. <laughs> oh, you be in the middle of February, Mary. <laughs> Thank you for giving me hearts. You guys, it's like I'm so out of my comfort zone. So thank you for your love. Thank you for your love. I think it's hot, sweetheart. I know how it is. Let's see. It's a sizzle. <laughs> it's a sizzle. Okay. Good gravy. I can't believe it. Oh, it fell apart a little bit. Oh, my God. <laughs> this just... So out of my comfort zone. I'm ready for, you know, my comfort zone. And most of us are like, just give me meat and tacos. Just give me meat. Grind up. But you know what? Sometimes you just have 
to try something a little different. <laughs> and it's very intimidating. It is. It's very intimidating. It's interesting here. Oil is not spreading around like I'm used to. There's my big ass pan. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to turn it up. I know it's probably not the right answer. Johnny Angel's like, you're supposed to let it settle and cook. I just want it to get done. I want it to cook and get ready because I'm hungry. I'm hungry. All right. You guys have watched me do the tofu. I'm turning it up. I think it matters. If it burns, he'll say, well, it's your own darn fault in the International Chili Society <laughs> one of the um, prefaces before you do your tequila shot in the morning is if you're not having fun it's your own damn fault and I am having fun but I need to do a good job so I feel a little intimidated Johnny Angel did make the tartar sauce And we put it, oh yeah, and we're marinating the slaw. I am going to turn it up to 11. Because <laughs> I, mean, I just want to have one of these <laughs> vegan. So I said, Johnny Angel, we're having a fish taco th this evening. He's like, ick. It's like, well, it's not really fish taco. The really only thing I can figure out that makes it what would be a fish taco is the tartar sauce. And he made the tartar sauce. Hey, Daddy. Love you, Poppy. <laughs> and um, so... He's like, oh, I like the tartar sauce, which is only mayonnaise, pickles, and capers. Mmm, I love capers. They're salty, salty, salty. Yummy, yummy. Not a big fan of mayonnaise, but and we're going to have lots of extra leftovers. Like, yeah, are you going to eat them? Are you going to eat that much? Let me taste it. I think it's going to need, I think it needs something else. Right. It's so mayonnaise-y. Johnny loves mayonnaise. I prefer mustard over mayonnaise. It's pretty good. That's what the recipe called for. Okay. Put this up in a pan. Let's do this taco. <laughs> Capers and green. We're not doing green peas, Poppy. <laughs> we are doing um, dill pickles, which we know Mama loves. And... Mm, Different. Um, mayonnaise. I don't know. I don't think mayonnaise. I just have to think. This is very. I just. Wow. Those folks that don't eat meat or or flour. I mean, if you are vegan. I guess if you were raised that way, you know how to go there and do that and what your go-to ingredients are. But if you're not, if you weren't ra raised that way, wow, what a challenge. Oh, my heavens. That's so, that's so challenging to me. When you grew up eating anything 
find it moved that your father would hunt, <laughs> which he did, and we ate most of it. Although we had rules. <laughs> so interesting. So um, in today's age, um, catfish is like exquisite, right? But my father would say, ew, he would not eat <laughs> catfish, but we would eat crab, which was the same darn thing. The same darn thing. Hey, Betsy. Betsy Hancock. So amazing. Love you, girlfriend. Hope you're doing well. I'm trying to fix a healthy uh, vegan <laughs> taco. Because Johnny Angel does not like fish, and I told him we're having fish tacos, and he goes, mm, and then he has no idea. And he helped me fix it. So we're making, frying it up in a pan, <laughs> some yummy, really, really fancy. It is fancy. Johnny Angel helped me fix this. Put all the seasonings together. You would not, if you were to look at this, you would never know this was tofu. Never, ever know. And when you taste it, you're not going to know it either. Because I'm not, I mean, I've only cooked with tofu a few times. Has anybody else cooked with tofu? It really does, I think, take on. The flavor of the seasonings that you put with it. And let me tell you, if you're on the taco cleanse, <laughs> which means no hamburger, no chicken, <laughs> no pork, it's all vegan. So this is tofu, you guys. <laughs> it's fun to try stuff. It's fun to try stuff new. But I don't know how I'm going to stick with this. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to put this little corn tortilla right in here. Right up in the pan. And then we're going to fix this up with the slaw I already did that Jenny helped me make. Okay, it's going to be good. It's just some, I know it's going to be good. It's just a little bit of a fancy. It's too fancy. And trust me, I love fancy. I love fancy trucks. I love fancy food. I love fancy cowboy hats. I love fancy boots. I love fancy. I love fancy. But I'm sticking out some fancy food. We're mini. Oh my god, it's so fancy. I'm so nervous because it's so much. This is good. It's good. Just be confident in that, then it's going to be good. And you don't have to be perfect on the time. Okay, good. You don't have to be perfect on the time. You know, I'm not used to always, always having a taco. So I'm going to put my corn tortilla in here. And then, oh, no, no, too soon, too soon. Do a little squall. I think it's going to be delicious. I put all the good stuff in there. It should be delicious, right? <laughs> all right. 
Uh, is it a vegan tortilla? It's a corn tortilla. I think it's vegan. And then, um, fancy, fancy, schmancy, slaw. <laughs> Thank you, Jamie, for helping me. Actually, Jamie helped me with more of that. He's like, ooh, I don't like, I don't like this stuff. Of course, none of them. Well, some people like it. I like it. Okay, so then I'm going to come right up in the morning. And it just unplugged. Sorry about that, guys. Let me replug. Okay, there we are. Little tofu. Um, they're supposed to be triangles according to the recipe, but mine are meatballs. Not meatballs, but, you know. And then I got a little, oh, here you go. A little scoop of the tartar sauce. This is not to be used. Okay, gravy in the morning. This is so damn gourmet. You better be good. You better be. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Okay, I didn't fry my corn tortilla up in a pan like I did last week with the um, coconut oil. So I can already tell that my first bite is only going to be with the um, cabbage. Fancy small. Mm -mm -mm. I love that. I, I love cumin. I, I, I have the cumin flavor. Mm -mm -mm. I have a cumin secret if you're competing in chili, if you want to know. <laughs> Just saying. Okay. Okay, that was one bite. I think I need another one. Okay, that slow is fancy. So delicious. Okay, it's time for <laughs> the vegan fish. I gotta squish it in there. We got the homemade tartar sauce. Let me see. Please be good. Please be good. <laughs> it's good, y'all. Does have a fishy flavor. <laughs> I can't believe it. I mean, not fishy, fishy, but. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. It's so good, y'all. It does have a tendency towards it. Mm. Of my tortilla fell apart. Mm hmm. The mixings is all good. I can tell you this is not a quick, <laughs> this is not a quick Taco Tuesday. It's fun to change it up every once in a while, though, you guys. <laughs> this is delicious, though. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Gourmet, 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 gourmet. Took a lot of preparation. Here's the thing, though, is that we have leftovers. I don't want to have to do the gourmet thing on Tuesday nights. <laughs> but I do have all these great leftovers. I mean, this small is amazing. You guys saw me make it. It's easy. Everything is easy to do. You just have to um, be in the mindset and do it one a period at a time. I'm not sure I'm going to be on the taco cleanse for very much longer. <laughs> hey, you guys. Thank you so much for being a part of Taco Tuesday. I'm going to sign off now. If you need some bright life and love. <laughs>
I'm I'm here for you and I am going to sign off now and I just want to say thank you for being a part of Taco Tuesday peace love and hot stuff baby can't wait to see you till next Tuesday God bless you thank you Heather God bless you I appreciate you so much. Love y'all, everybody. See you next Tuesday. Love y'all.